After that crazy week last week. That was a crazy ass week. Overwhelmingly, man. the feedback was great on last week's uh, shows. Yes, very It worked positive. out well. It worked Nicely. out well. It ran its course. Of course it did. Well, we finished strong on Friday. By, by and... Tuesday. <laughs> yeah, it really did by Tuesday. Holy shit. Yeah. I love on th I guess it was Thursday when you were like, uh, yeah, I tapped I'm out. I'm yeah. done. I tapped we, out. I think it was Thursday. Halfway through yeah. the show. And we still had Friday left. But then came on strong Friday. Yeah. We finished strong on Friday. Is there like something happening with her? Does, why is... Yeah, Bobo's involved I don't feel like doing the this. bit today. I'm just going right yeah. for it. Uh, Bobo what? Yeah, Bobo. Four sweet lady. Bobo what? Uh, Bo Bobo. Hello? Bobo. Bobo. Hello? He just plows why, right why into... Why does he... Why can't he... Bobo. Yeah, I'm here, lady. Can't... Bobo! <laughs> He's the worst. He's why terrible. do I talk to him? He's the worst. It's terrible. Bobo. Yeah? Can we start with, hi, how are you? Yeah, how... All right, well, well, how are you guys doing? <laughs> <laughs> I go, hi, and he goes, bloody diapers. Uh, right, yeah, he just plows, plows right through. into... Uh, how about we have a little conversation? This is a talk show. Uh, okay. <laughs> All right, I'm hanging up uh, on you until you do this on. proper. Regroup and calls back. Mm. Something, wow. Something with Lady Die. Yes. I don't know exactly. I was what. hearing rumors and whatnot. Really? Well, yeah. I don't know if they're true. He'll call back and hopefully we could do it proper. Yeah. I guess they found the plane, huh? It's pretty obvious now. Mm hmm. They actually uh, got objects. They got a boat uh, very close to the objects. And they're, really? They're about to confirm this thing finally. Well, yeah. Spotted by who? If it was the Chinese, I'm not believing it. It was uh, Australian. Australian aircraft spots t t new objects in Hunt for Flight 370. Oh no! And they're not going to they're not going to lose those objects anytime soon. So it's just a really? matter of uh, you know taking a, a closer look. But, but they don't know if that's uh, the plane. They're pretty confident. I th oh this, yeah. I think this is finally it. Yeah. Finally. Did they said that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. More or less. More or less. Uh, Bobo's on the line. Hi, Bobo. Hey. hey, good morning, guys. How you guys doing? <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Very good. That's all I wanted. I want to feel like I have friends out there. Like a normal conversation. Right. See how nice that was, Bobo? Yep, I see, I see that. I'm doing uh, very well. I had a, a pretty, you know, boring weekend, but well-rested and ready to go again. How was your weekend, Bobo? Mm, but, but, but similar. Similar? Just nothing uh, too spectacular? No, not be too spectacular. See, we're teaching them people skills. Did you see UConn? They had a nice victory. Yeah, but I, saw, I, I saw that. I got, I got some, got some friends of mine up in Connecticut that make a big deal of the U, UConn. Well, and, of the the, the and, UConn. And how do you feel about Wichita? Wichita, I think, because of big upset. I. I was also kind of paying attention more to college basketball more than I usually do because all of a sudden, because oh. uh, Colin wants to win, wants to win that bet that that millionaire guy. Is well, first of all, he's a billionaire, and no one's going to be w uh, winning that. No, everyone's out. Something tells me Colin's undefeated so far, though, according to his Twitter. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it looks to me like Colin might be undefeated on his way to the oh, billion wow. dollars so far. <laughs> Even though there was a huge announcement that everyone is out officially. Right. The last Already? Guy, yeah, the last guy's out. Yeah, no one's going to be winning, uh, what was it, Warren Buffett's billion dollars? Billion How dollars. far into it are they that, that someone's... We're down to, uh, we're just about at the Sweet 16, right? Didn't the top seed get fucking dumped? Yeah, that's why I said Wichita. Yeah. Wichita yeah. was undefeated, and their hopes of a uh, undefeated season of 40-0 and 0 is gone as Kentucky beat them. Mm -hmm. That's always the way it is. You want to lose once during the year to get it out of the way. You want to yeah. miss once, you want to fuck up once, because it's going to happen, and you don't want it to happen. You don't want it to happen at the end, right? it's the end of the season for you. Yeah. Oh boy, take that up with Mark Cuban. Oh Why? shit. He, he says that's bullshit. Really? He, he hates when people say what you just said. Yeah, well, oh, that's good shit. for him. I hate I, do, no, I no. just read his. <laughs> 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 Where's his tweet? I got it. <laughs> Close. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh -huh. hey, what were we going to say, though? No. Uh, uh, Can you write just, it down? Yeah. It won't make sense. I'll tell you over. Uh, let's just say. Um, yeah, here he it is. Here it say is. That, but it's, re it's reality. Yeah. It's the Daily News. They do these, like, sports tweets in the, in the uh, sports you know, section. Uh, M. Cuban tweeted, which idiot media person? 
president <laughs> is going to ask the Wichita State coach and players if they thought it would have been better to lose a game pre NCAA. Oh shit! <laughs> oh my goodness, Jimmy. I'll tell you, I'll tell you the reasoning behind that is because when you're there's pressure. These are they're, they're, they're people playing these games, and you're aware. I must say you can't be undefeated. Yeah. But you know that you're undefeated, and there's an additional pressure. I think with being undefeated, yeah. where every mistake is like, uh, am I going to lose this? Is it going to blow? The, is this going to blow the streak? I think if you've got I, one, it just becomes a little easier to focus on. The I game. actually agree with you wholeheartedly. Mm. That's something that's out of your mind. Like, okay, two. We have a really good season, but right. oh my god, we're we're still undefeated. I think two that plays. Idiot broadcast. I think yeah. that plays wow. with your mind. Absolutely. <laughs> It's yeah. like some weird panicky thing, I think, happens yeah. in like, your brain. But again, again, maybe Who he's knows? right technically. Like Morton Anderson, I'll never forget that one field goal. He had missed, he made every one all year, and the oh, one yeah, he yeah, missed yeah. cost him the postseason. That's the one. What about the Patriots? They lose the Super Bowl after. Oh, fuck. yeah, yeah, fuck. I wonder, I wonder if that had something to do with it. Who knows? Who knows? I feel like it. It. it it's in your head, though. Yeah. Bobo! Oh. So Wichita State lost to Kentucky, so that's it for them. Isn't it almost if you're doing like this bracket thing, aren't you almost better off just finding out like a lot of the team? Oh, there's no way to predict what teams will be where. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's why. Right, yeah, so you just guess, you random guesses. Yeah, there's always some weird, you know, team that does much better than anyone expected, and there's always mm -hmm. a few ups, you know, upsets. It's tough. What was the score of that that upset? Was it like a, a two point game? I really don't know. Was it a close game? I have no idea. I, I was watching. Uh, I watched the UConn game. That was that was an exciting one. Dude, I wish I liked college sports. I mm. wish I did because it's so yeah, big. No college real. basketball is pretty. It, you can jump right on brackets, board. Brackets, brackets, These brackets, games are pretty good. March Madness. So, Bobo, what do you got? What's the breaking news? Well, well, the breaking news is that all of a sudden, Lady Di called me, and I wasn't sure why she was calling me. She Bobo, Bobo, and I'm not trying to do it, but I swear. Are you on a cell phone? Yes, I'm on a cell phone. Can, do, can you call from your mom's house phone? Not busy, busy making some call right now. But what happened to Lady Di was she got mugged. <laughs> Lady Di got mugged? Mugged. Yeah, she got mugged. Like, probably every her, her entire purse was stolen. And for some reason, she had a, she saw the paper with the phone number written down. See, it's my number out of all numbers. Still out of paper with your number wait, on wait, it. Wait, wait, wait. So Lady Di was mugged. And so, calls you. And calls you because that's the only number she has on her? Why? Did they take her phone? Yep, they took her phone. Just about everything. They took just about everything, and she just happened to have your number, so she called you. Well, that's but that's the, that's the start of a horror movie. <laughs> You're mugged, and that's the one phone number you have. <laughs> oh my god! What a, oh my god! What do I, cause been the big question is: Do I call this person or oh, yeah. just kill myself now? Yeah. <laughs> what the hell? Are you serious? Uh, I'm telling the truth here. She was saying she was bruised. It it was she. She probably had a lost everything, and she called me on Bill's phone. How did it happen? He just said she got mugged. My my mom only had more details already. She, she was even thinking my mom could help her. Help her how? Right. How could Bobo's mom help Lady Die? Yeah. She doesn't exactly have a big success history at home. Because <laughs> <laughs> you want to speak to her. Hold on, hold on Mom. They want to speak to you. What? When did, did we, we say that? Did we say that? We're part of this whole... When did we say that? I didn't. Hello? Bobo's mom. <laughs> yes, yeah, my first name. Hi, what what, what, what happened to Lady Di? Yeah. Well, she says she was um, on her way out of a chicken place. She went out to eat, and um, when she got to her truck, someone pushed her against her and knocked her down, knocked her down on the floor. And um, they grabbed her bag. Where was she eating? Uh, she was at some chicken place in New Jersey. I uh oh, know. a chicken place. A chicken place oh, no. in Jersey. Oh boy, oh, no. World Star. Oh boy, I hope it turns up on World Star. <laughs> yeah, it, it'll be like the fucking uh, puppet from Saw seen in person. <laughs> <laughs> its purse was had no good contents in it. Oh, oh my god. god. Make of her. I'm sure she was happy. Yeah, she was, she looked lovely. Oh, brother. So she was coming out of a chicken place. 
because your phone's a little crappy. She's walking back to her car, and she got mugged, and they took her uh, pocketbook, phone, money. Yeah, money. Yeah, she had all that stuff there. She had her keys in her pocket, and it was just lucky for that that she was able to get home. She did report it to the police, and um, that's all I know. Wait, she reported it to the police? Yes, she did. She said she reported it to the police. I told her we needed a report because she needs help getting back her license and her oh. birth certificate. And apparently she's got a computer, so I told her we'll help her this morning. So and you're you're uh, you're very involved with this. Well, I would try not to be, but I know hmm. she's a friend of the show, and she needs help, and she doesn't ask for money. She did not ask for money. Uh huh. Wait, what well, was that part? She didn't awful. ask for money. She... No, she didn't ask for money. I offered a couple of dollars. She didn't want any money. Mm. So we got to call Lady Di. Now we got to call what? And, Bill's, and Bill's she talked number? to Doctor Steve. So now we got to get Doctor Steve on the phone. We were going to move on from we Lady so Di, but this on. is like this is breaking news. Yes. We're Pacino in the Godfather three. Yes, yes, exactly. <laughs> we were out. We were out, and we got to <laughs> pull us back in. Then pulled back in again. Me though. Huh? She described what the guy looked like. She, she said she was the police a description this morning. Yeah, it sounds like a description of everybody that mugs anybody, to tell you the truth. That's what I heard. That's what? what I heard. Oh, no. So it must have been, per they must have described the clothing then. Yeah, yeah. Of <laughs> jeans and sneakers. And she did describe his um, he... race, too, so... Well, yeah. Well, that's just black, black, black male. Right. Black male, mid to late 20s, uh, wearing a hoodie. <laughs> and we would like to lose just a black hoodie. That's <laughs> it. Hoodie that Hoodie's up for robbery. Do you guys have a house phone? Your, your cell phone is horrible. Oh, well, yes, we do, but I'm going to do Sounds like you're, sounds like she's talking through one of those paper and combs that you used to go, <laughs> wah, 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 wah. you're talking through a kazoo. <laughs> do you have AT&T? Yes, I do. Uh, uh, how does that company still function? I, I have AT and T. The, the service has gotten way better. Oh, for has me. it gotten better for me? Uh, We're going to. Um, I don't know. You might be changing carriers again, but yeah, cool. All right, mm -hmm. All right. Well, uh, Mrs. Uh, Bobo's mom. Thank you so much. You want, uh, who was I? Who am I speaking with? Uh, Opie, Anthony, Jimmy Norton. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, Bobo's All right, mom. Thank you. All right. We would talk to her more, but her phone is hard. Yeah, that is a terrible phone. Thank God. We got to get Dr. Steve on the line. And should we call Lady <sighs> Di's house? We, I guess we got Bill's number. Yeah, we're calling Bill. So we can call Bill. Right. Hello, Bill. Oh, I think this is a big cover up. I think it was Bill. Uh, Lady Di. Hi, how you doing? Oh, uh, look, how are you? Lady Di. Lady Di, we sure didn't see this coming. I'm not good at all. Much like you. All right, so hold on, hold on, hold on. So, is that, is that Jimmy in the background, right? Yes, I'm, Jimmy's I'm back. Yes. So listen, Lady Di. Yes. So uh, you had a great week of radio with us. The, yes, I did. The feedback I, was amazing for uh, the yeah. most part. Uh -huh. and, and then Friday ended, and we all had to go our separate ways. So first of all, what happened Friday after the show? Oh, no, 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 no. What, what happened Friday, I, I went over to uh, uh, the sub no, no. party rock. And I had a few drinks. Wait, where'd so, you go? Blarney Rock. It's a bar. Blarney Rock. Blarney, Blarney Rock. Rock. Yeah, Blarney Rock on 33rd Street. I think oh. it's on 33rd. So couple, right tipped a couple of bags. How many uh, beers did you have at Blarney Rock? Uh, there, I had about maybe four, four or five. It seems like four, 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 four or five. <laughs> this is why we didn't want to give you any. This is hold on. This is why we didn't want to give you all that money at once. This is exactly what I said would happen. Yes, and she said, "No, no, I'm not going. I'm going right home." You said you were going to go ho right home with your money. Right. I I was going to go. But what happened was I had something to eat along with that. I had I had the uh, uh, chicken fingers. <laughs> Along so, with the beers. Then I went Hold on, hold on. So four or five beers. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Every, hold on, hold on. Yeah. S slow down. Go ahead. Slow down. It's Monday. So uh, what was your bill at Blarney Rock? Huh? What, what, what was that? What was the bill? How much money did you spend there? I don't know. Maybe about $40. <laughs> 
Yeah, she seems okay. to drink. Hold on, Doug, one second, Sudo. She seems to drink a lot around that area because that's where uh-huh. the uh, the Port Authority is so, or, or Penn Station. So right, she seems yeah. to drink around thirty third, thirty fourth. Like right before she gets on the train, she goes, "I'm going to have one." A little cocktail. And the next thing you know, it's you know two chicken finger dumps later and a <laughs> right. like half keg of beer with the rest of the commuters. Right. Yeah. They have figured out those bars around Penn Station oh, yeah. and Port Authority. Yeah. All right. So. The Blarney Rock is a good bar, and they're cheap over there. They are cheap. Okay, so then you... Um, okay. It's not the Blarney Stone? Uh, Blarney Rock. That's the name of the place. I, I think she's Whatever. probably right. It's a Flintstones yeah, bar. Yeah, the Blarney. Someone else had Blarney Stone. They the went Blarney the Rock. Blarney Rubble. <laughs> right. That's the name of the... That's the name of the bar. I, we're, we're in agreement. It's fine. So yeah, then, right. you did you uh, jump on a bus to go home? No, I paid my phone bill. And then what I did was... Uh, and then I got on the train, and I came home. You paid your phone bill. Yeah, I paid my phone bill in New York. Yeah. Oh, you went to like a store and just oh, paid your phone good bill. Good thing. Okay. I paid my phone bill. All right. Then jumped on a train. Now where are we at? And then I then I got on the train. Yep. Okay. Um, and uh, uh, the conductor of the train did not tell people that are going to Elizabeth to uh, you know go by a certain door. Okay, like you have to walk up a couple of cars, you know, to go to the store. So I winded up in Linden. Okay, instead of uh, instead of Elizabeth, and right. I had to take the train. I had to take a train back home, so that was another two dollars for me. Two you know, dollars, forty bucks on beer, but she's looking at the two dollars. So basically, it went a stop too far. She got out and turned around. Exactly. And I, would, I, I yeah. think it's pretty close so, to Elizabeth. All right, go ahead. Yeah, it is close to Elizabeth Linden train station. Okay, all right. I was pissed off. I mean, come on, man. You know the the lady should have said, "Walk up to the." Whatever. Whatever. No one cares about this part of the story. Whatever. Even when even when you're right, you're wrong. Oh. And I take I took the cab home. Okay. You and took I the had, cat home. Cab. 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 Oh, C-A-B. Oh, okay, sorry. I heard but cat I in there somehow. The bus. What? I just. I just I was too tired to take Who a gives a shit about this part of the fucking story? This was like Friday when you went on the after show with Sam. I wanted to drive my car into a pole. You wanted to get to the fucking point. I like the details. So you, so yeah. then you, you took a cab home, and then what happened? What don't you like about the bus? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing happened after that. Oh. I stayed home. Did, did, went to bed early? Because, you know, you got like five or six beers in you at this point. Yeah. Had a few natty ices at home. Some chicken fingers rumbling yeah, away yeah, in her yeah. gullet. Right. Yeah, yeah. And uh, and then Saturday, okay, um, this all this happened Saturday night. All right. All right. This whole entire, this whole entire mugging thing happened Saturday night. So you really did get mugged. Yes, I got mugged. I'm telling Jeez. you. Jeez. You want to... Uh, do you want to talk to Bill? He could talk to I, no, 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 no. No Bill today. I want you to describe. We weren't even going to talk to you happened. today. Yeah, what happened Saturday? We what? need to know how this happened. Uh, and I went, I, I went to the chicken place on Saturday. Okay. Hold on. What's the name of the chicken place? Well, uh, I went to a chicken place to get something to eat. What's the name of the chicken place? You, no, the name is not important. What's the, the name important. of the chicken place? What, what? Do you want to know the name of the chicken place? Because you got mugged outside the chicken place. We're trying to figure out what neighborhood it's in. All right, all right. I'll, I'll, I'll let you know the name, but, you know. but. It's, it's, What's why, the why? name of the chicken place? Why the fuck wouldn't oh. she just say it? Why weren't you popular at the Chicago Police Department? <laughs> she got mugged and we're mad at her. But this is what happens. What's the name of the chicken place? Who are you protecting? It's called Crown Chicken. That's Crown okay. Chicken. That's why we not asked KFC, for the name. Okay. Not fucking Popeyes even. It's Crown Chicken. Crown Chicken. Crown is... Oh, and they uh, crowned you. <laughs> Crown is definitely a chicken place you, you find in a lot of uh, right. ghetto areas. It's not a ghetto area. <laughs> it is a well, you know, that, I don't know. Whatever. All right, so you went to get chicken for what? You and Bill? Were you bringing it home? Did you eat there? I, uh, I, I went, actually, I went to the chicken place to get, I, I looked at the menu. I was going to get chicken, but then I said, no, let me get something different. Who <laughs> gives a fuck? What kind of soda were you going to get? Calm down, Shit. Andrew. You had a great oh, weekend. You made some money. Let's, let's relax. Yeah, I want to hear her menu yeah. uh, debating so, before the mugging. That's so so what, you decided to get what uh, over chicken? You know, like a fried, uh, uh, what did I get? Fried whiting, the, you know, the, the a fish. I got fish instead of chicken. Oh, fish at Crown's chicken. Yeah. Fish well, at cr- boy, Holy you know. shit! I hope they boil the hell out of that. <laughs> I know how fresh that is. No kidding. Yeah. But, but anyway, so it's probably rat. I had my taco book. What kind of what kind of fish do they serve at Crown? You know, I, I honestly do need to know this because that sounds crazy. What, what is, kind of fish is it? You're looking 
concerned about the the, uh, the food. Yes. What happened to the fish? What kind of fish? What do you mean? I just told you that. But is it is it uh, how is it prepared? No, what fish was it? It, it was whiting. It's all prepared the same way. I don't know what <laughs> yeah. that means. I have a it's trout dog. That's or a clam witch. It's a whiting. Whiting. That's what. That's what is. they said when they saw you standing outside. <laughs> 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 all right. So you uh, you didn't eat in Crown Chicken. I did too. I, I ate whatever I could, and I decided to. Uh, uh, take the rest home, so I had it wrapped Oh, up. my God. All right. Th that's why. Okay. So you're sitting there eating. Yes. Yes. Somebody was somebody was watching you. Someone saw the zebra at the watering hole. <laughs> somebody watched <laughs> the hippo Obviously at the watering hole. Me. Somebody watched and, and realized, yeah, the, the hippo had a bad leg. Had, had, is limping mm -hmm. by the oh, watering God. hole. What were you doing at Crown know. Chicken that that would have would have made someone think that maybe you were an easy target? Were you counting your money at the table that you made, or? No, no. Uh, maybe when I uh, when I took out the money to pay for the chicken, maybe they saw the rest of it. Oh, what'd you take out? Like a couple of hundreds. They saw the rest of it when I took the money out. Maybe they looked overlooked. Were you flashing some hundies? Were you flashing some hundreds? No, I wasn't flashing anything. How much did you guys give her? I wasn't here. Uh, it turned out to be almost four hundred. I think four hundred dollars cash on Friday, wow. not counting all the money we gave during the week. Wow. You know what, guys? Guys, guys, please, if you don't listen to me, all right, I'm not going to finish the story. You're right. You know what? <laughs> you know what? You fucking me. piece of shit. <laughs> right, she's right. With your fucking bullshit you details. What do you mean you're not going to finish Relax. the story? We're trying to help right. you. You're right, Di. We apologize for our rude interruptions and our crass talk. So so they, somebody might have seen you pulling out a lot of money to pay for your meal at Crown Chicken. It could be, but I don't think I pulled out all all that money. All right, so nothing mm. else. I don't think I pulled the whole thing out, huh? Nothing else at Crown Chicken that would have been suspicious. Uh huh. Uh, I don't know. I mean, you know, uh, uh, let's put it this way: if I wasn't there, somebody else would have been the target. Well, okay. that's Maybe. usually the case. Yes. <laughs> Obviously, was waiting for somebody to open up a pocketbook, and oh. it happened to be me. Okay, so then you leave Crown Chicken. Now walk us yeah. through this. Now I left. I left Crown Chicken. Okay, and I was walking towards the liquor store. Now, I'm not going to lie to you. I was going to get a 30-pack, all right? And, uh, you know, I had to get, I was going to get something for Bill. I was going to get him a couple of six-packs. Can I ask you, is this, the, is this, uh, is this the fame? Go ahead, Di. Is this the famous li liquor store you've talked about? Yeah. Okay, don't name him. Don't name this place anymore. They don't yeah. take no, care of you. They, yeah. They, they, no, they have nothing to do with this. But they don't which, which take place? care of you, so don't mention the name. Yeah. But, all right, so you're, you're going there to get a 30-pack. What? And is this close to the Crown Chicken? Yeah. Okay. The Crown Chicken is about two doors down. Oh, okay. So All right. All right. So you don't, you're not going back to your car yet. So you go to the liquor store, and what happens? No, I, I, did, I didn't even make the liquor store. The guy mugged me already. And then I called the cops and everything. Wait, no, no, you don't just stop and they mugged me. You got you go through the detail of the menu at Crown Chicken, but then you go, he mugged me, and I called the cops. Walk us through the mugging, you fuck. I'm the one doing most of the talking. I'm trying to talk. I know. No, no that's no, right. No, no, no. I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to like make sure we get the oh, details boy. of the story. So you leave Crown Chicken. What happens? I got mugged right there on the, on the sidewalk. Right outside the door? Right outside. I was walking down. Maybe I took about four steps and boom, 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 this guy got me. Okay, what did, what did he do? Oh. <laughs> what did he say? What did he do? What happened to you? <laughs> Were there people around? What time of day right. was this? Now we want details right. and she won't fucking get Did you have the potatoes with gravy? <laughs> oh, go ahead. What, what, time, what time was this at? Uh, this was about um, 930 at a Saturday night. You're crazy. Go to a crown chicken yeah, at nine thirty at night. So what happened? What happened? He he ran. He ran with my pocketbook. No, what the holy <laughs> shit! I swear <laughs> to God. Why does this happen? What, what happened? How did he mug you? Describe the mugging. He ran behind me. Right. All right. Pushed me down to the ground. Took my pocketbook and ran and ran the other way, the opposite way. Okay. Were you the only? Let me ask you. Were you the only white person in the chick crown chicken, or was it a pretty mixed place? Um, I would say I was the only white person in there. Yeah, exactly. But you actually just sat there except and... For, except for the person, except for the manager. Of course. So <laughs> you didn't feel, like, um, uncomfortable at all? Or, like, you'd eaten there before? No, I ate there before. Okay. I, I never thought something like this would happen. 
I ate there before. I mean, you all right, know. we heard you. All right, all right, all right. I'm not right. accusing you of not eating there before. Yeah, so, <laughs> so the guy, it was quick. He pushed you, grabbed your pocketbook, and ran. And and did was there any witnesses to this? Yes, there was. Who? There was people outside. There were witnesses. Was that, were they laughing? Yeah, well, I know that. I know I had no business being out. You don't need another yeah, he's fucking drink. Okay, that was. Bill we, get, we now no. need. We now need Bill on the phone. Can you give us Bill for a second, and we'll go back to you. Uh, well, he's, he's not a very happy person, so I. Why would he Why would he be? Look where he lives. No. What? Nothing. Okay. Let us talk to Bill for a second. Uh, you're not going to like this guy. Okay. Okay. All right. Hold on. Oh, good. I thought we were going to move on from Lady Di. I, I, I know. But she got mugged. Hey, what's up, guys? What are hey. you doing? God, Bill, Bill, Bill. Sorry, you doing? sorry to hear about Lady Di. That's hmm. crazy. She's out at 9.30 at night on a Saturday right. at a Crown Chicken? Yeah. And it's not a good neighborhood. It's, uh, of course not. Uh, say, at nighttime. Right, right. So, uh, okay, okay, you got the Mavalock Manor there. It's all drugs, all wives. Whatever. Okay? Uh huh. Why would she go there? Isn't there other places to go to eat? Well, actually, the re reason why I'm really pissed off. Yep. She had 28 cans of beer in the refrigerator. She's fucking drunk. Gets in my fucking truck and drives. Oh, boy. She yeah, drove your truck? Yeah. And so she felt like she needed more beer, even though there were 28 cans in the refrigerator. Yep, and then she gets mugged on the sidewalk, pretty much right outside the Crown, uh, the Crown oh, Chicken. Like down, no, it's actually um, I don't know what it is. I don't go that way. I don't go, it's like a couple of doors down from the right. liquor store. <clears throat> right, man. And uh, I was sleeping, and you know she does this all the time. She sneaks out. I know when she goes out because of my. Of my truck keys, I put them a certain way. Uh huh. I know when she goes out, when she comes in. So she's so sitting at home, she's getting lit up, and uh, oh. then she decides she needs more beer, even though there's beer in the fridge. So she hops yeah. in your vehicle all drunk. Yep. Yeah. <sighs> and someone sees her staggering around drunk. Well, I'm They're sure. going to just grab her pocketbook. Well, and... Yeah, well, because you're an easy hit. Right. You're an easy hit. All I got to do is push you and you fall down. Yep. Yeah. Push her, she falls down, you grab the pocketbook, and you're out of there within oh seconds. God, she is a victim, perpetual victim. <laughs> it's like blowing out a candle, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <It's so laughs> I love it. I'm sorry, Bill. That sounds uh, yeah, awful, big man. fat candle. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Anything else you want to add to the story? What? <laughs> I ain't gonna say nothing about that. A lot of them got gray locks. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of them. A lot of them have dreadlocks, huh? Yeah, right. Why? Well, she I hear you. she really thinks she's got a description. I would love to hear Lady Di's description of the guy. Oh yeah, let's. Uh, can we get her back on the phone? Can we talk to uh, Di again? No, 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 this is funny. Yeah. He had a hoodie on with Draylocks. <laughs> Draylocks. He had Draylocks. <laughs> Draylocks and a hoodie, and, yeah. and Lady Di thinks she's got a description. Is what you're saying? Yeah. yeah well, uh, like I said, uh, I don't know. I, she does stupid shit when she's drunk. Well, and now I she mean, lost her phone with all her contacts, and oh, what a nightmare! Yeah, and that's the whole problem. You know, she went over to your show uh, last week. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. You know, I didn't mind that at all. Okay, she's going over there, whatever. You, you guys are her friends. She, she liked doing it. Whatever it is, you know, she's made close to five hundred dollars going back and forth. <sighs> No, well, maybe no, no. It was three hundred because that three hundred dollars in her account, oh, which I put money in. What? It's not yeah. going to cost three hundred dollars for one week of getting. Yeah, it doesn't cost that much to go back and yeah, forth. Yeah, I think I, I think she, I think she was fibbing you because she wanted to stop and have a few belts. Exactly. Yeah, I don't. I don't think it's called alcohol. 
Okay. Yeah. Right. You drink in New York, you're paying eight, nine dollars, ten dollars a beer. Exactly. Okay, and she was drinking the twenty-two ounce Friday uh, pints instead of these sixteen ounce, and you drink four or five, and then you got to be halfway shit faced. <laughs> Bill, we're starting to think she has a drinking problem. Yeah, we're trying to figure it out. Well, actually, <laughs> well, I, met her, I met her like seven what years ago. Where, yeah. Where did you meet her? The TB ward? <laughs> <laughs> so you meet her uh, seven years ago? Yeah, uh, she was homeless. Took her off the street. Mm -hmm. Okay. We remember that. Yeah, we were... Yeah, okay. I'm not lying on it. Oh, yeah. No, I, I, I know. I got a good job, yep. making a couple thousand a week, mm. you know, and she lived with me and my buddy Jeff. Uh, we had a room. I lost my house. Boy, I, boy, I ain't talking about that. All right. But, you know, I used to get her, you know, a 12 pack a day. And that was cool. And she was, she was all right. But when she got her father's money, okay. Yeah. She was drinking 30, 36 cans of beer a day. Holy 36 shit. 36 cans now of beer. Now we're getting to the bottom day. of this. Yeah, the, yeah. Bill, there's no way hmm. she was drinking that, that many beers a day. Want to make a bet? No, I'm just, I bet she was. I bet she kiss. I'm just saying it in a way like I can't believe it, but I guess it's got to be true. It is. I uh, believe it. 30 to 36 cans a day? If you start at 8, 9 in the morning. Wow. Probably very late. easy to. No, that's late. That's late, huh? Seven, six. Six, seven in the morning. Yeah. Hey, Bill, let me ask you a question. Does she vomit in the sink in the bathroom? Cool. Yeah. Mm. Does she, so she, she, did you ever she just walk in there and find the vomit in the sink? Well, right now, uh, right now, she wakes up uh, every day like that. Yeah. yeah. What? Yeah. Sick? Pukes. Mm. Yeah, well, um, um, you know, I cut her down. She, she got her father's money. She went over the hill. Oh, yeah. And she went through that money fast, she right, Bill? She went through the money fast? About 10 months. Is she displaying fiscal irresponsibility? <laughs> she went through 60000 in 10 months. No, no, no. It was 30. Oh, 30. I think she said 60 at one point. Okay, 30000 no, She got 15 and 15. 15 the first time and after the, I don't know, the, what do you call that shit? I don't know. Whoa. Oh, Just yeah, sounds like was, a disaster. Yeah. All right. Oh, well, yeah. And then, uh, you know, you know, I cut her down. And what she started doing, I give her money for a 12-pack. That's a lot of loud or a 12-pack. Uh-huh. Like, when I got out of the hospital, her and Lisa were living here. I didn't drink for two years. Oh, wow. Okay. This is Kessel. <laughs> <laughs> why, why were you in the hospital, Bill? Oh, uh, I had a cyst on my pancreas. Jesus. Yeah, this I was just, in there three and weeks, the, three and a half weeks. And then you didn't drink for two years, and then you thought you were doing her a favor by cutting her down to a 12-pack a, a day. It's yep. a lot of beer. Yeah, that's a lot. That is a lot. Why'd you start again? Uh, that's what, 84 uh, cans a, a week? <laughs> oh my why, why and that's the cut again? down? Yeah, no, why? I, you know, oh, don't give me, excuse me? Why'd you start drinking again? Well, it was my birthday last year. Right, and uh, I was barbecuing and having a good time, so I, you know, I picked up a beer. And okay. Really, I said I drank too shit. <laughs> I didn't even like it. Uh huh. Okay. So anyway, I just it got to, uh, well, getting bored. Okay. Just bored, so a little drinking, yeah. right? <laughs> you know, two, all right. I buy two six packs and it'll last me two and a half days. And then uh, fast forward, you're back drinking pretty uh, heavily again. What, three, four beers a day? Oh, that's all you're doing right now? Yeah. And then what, Di drinks the rest, right? Right. All right, so let's no, get laid. <laughs> no, she don't, she don't touch my beer. Oh, boy. <laughs> all right, let's get Lady Di back in the phone. I want to hear her description yeah. of the, the mugger. Oh, a hoodie with Draylocks. So you all got them. <laughs> Who's they, Bill? What? Who has them? <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah, she goes. She, she, okay. Give her a couple of beers just over up. All right. All right. Thanks, Bill. Let's thanks for some more backstory on this. This. 
This. <laughs> this. Yeah. Die. Die. We got to move on. Die. Oh, boy. Oh, talk to him. Die. You don't need a beer. Right there. You don't need a beer that quick. What? She's grabbing a beer. Now. She's uh, got to get a beer. Yeah, yeah. She is a fucking disaster. <laughs> She's a disaster. It's 7.15 right. in okay, the morning. Why did you have to grab a beer? How many beers have you had so far? Just, uh, I only had the one. I just woke up a little while ago. <laughs> exactly. How about you start with a cup of coffee? Right? Some juice. Oh, coffee. Orange juice. Uh, water. Or something. Right. Water. So, uh, Bill said you have the description of the guy, but he kind of laughed. What, what's, yeah. the, what's the description of the mugger? A good description. Right. He has, well, he has socks. Okay. Uh, he was wearing a hoodie, yep. a gray hoodie, Okay, and he had blue jeans, you know, blue jeans on, and uh, he, was a, he was a fast runner, so, it, you know, that's the only uh, thing I have to say about him. So they're never uh, going to find the guy. You didn't describe... No, 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 no. You didn't describe uh, skin color. He was, he was getting uh, something for himself, okay, and, uh, you know, the, the booth was taken. They only have one booth in that place, and I was eating at the counter... Until the booth was clear, so he must have stole my pocketbook. Wait, right. you saw the guy? You saw the guy in the store first? Yes, he was in there first. Okay, people were telling me he was in there with with a few other people. Okay, and these people, instead of running after the guy, okay, you know, because I, you know, I, I, I ran around the corner. I'm like, where did he go? And he just he, like disappeared. Love to see he, that. In other words, you couldn't see him anymore. He he he, he ran he like a fast runner. Right. You know, and everybody's just standing there. They're like, "What happened?" When I, what happened? I said, "Well, what do you think happened?" World star. Uh, like a bunch of jerks doing nothing. They're like, "Oh, I feel bad for you." Yeah, you, well, you feel bad for me. What do you want them to do? Yeah, run after him. Yeah, they're not going to run after the guy. No one. They're sadly, waiting for, they're waiting for their own victims. <laughs> sadly, no one really helps you out when you need them. You know, I mean, they just stood there. They're like, "What happened?" I, I said, "Didn't you just see happened? I just got mugged." All right. uh, and they're just standing there like it, like nothing happened, you know? Well, in that town, it is nothing. And, and well, they, they they probably did not want to get involved. You uh, think? Probably. You're never going to find the guy. No. Well, whatever. So what did that, what, he got your pocketbook, your phone, how much money, what else was in the pocketbook? Oh, we uh, we went through the pocketbook, so we should know. There wasn't much in there. No. Well, I don't know. My credit card, but I already, I, I took care of that already. Right. Mm -hmm. The phone, I had that temporarily shut off. Right. Okay, I'm going to get another phone probably today, right, Bill? All right. Uh oh, Bill's going to pay for it. Okay. Yeah, well, uh, and now it's Bill's money that I have to count on. And that really sucks. Now, you know, I, the, the money, okay, um, I understand. He wants money. This person wanted money for, for whatever he was going to do that night. I, I oh, I'm sure it's yeah, help you know, buy whatever. books for school. Yeah, books or <laughs> yeah, whatever, helping whatever. Uh, right. crippled yeah, children. I'm not, I'm not I'm not going to speculate, but I really think it's going to be for doing drugs. Okay? That's uh, speculating. <laughs> That's speculating. You can't say I'm not going to speculate and then speculate. That doesn't work. Do you, want, do you want to know the amount I had in my pocketbook? Yes. Um, I would say uh, over $200. Pretty much the, the rest of the money that we gave her. Because I, you know, I really... And I, I, I said this was going to happen. Maybe not, maybe not a mugging, but I said, I, I don't know why we're any. giving her all this money. It's gonna, I it's said gonna it's going to be gone by Monday. Yeah. I said that. Yes, you can pull you the tape. Well, uh, we knew it would happen Whatever. some way. You're a you perpetual victim. Mugged. Right. You knew I was going to get mugged. No, I didn't say that. I said you would go through all your money by Monday. Oh. I said it on this no. show. No, I would have no. still had it. I would have still had it. Yeah. If had you, were, that you were down at 200. That's already half of it was gone. Right. right. And, it was, and, and that was only Saturday night. Well, I like Either way, that money was going to be gone by Monday morning. You'd have bought that 12 pack and then the 30, 30 pack. pack. I, no. I paid my phone bill <clears> in New York, okay? When I was in New York, I paid my bill. Good thing you paid that phone bill so the phone could get stolen. Right. And then I, now, now all of a sudden I don't have a phone anymore. Ain't that good? Ain't that great the way it works out like that? <sighs> no. I know. That's sort of what Anthony just said. Uh, it's just, it's horrible. I'm sorry. You know uh, what I mean? I'm sorry for you, Lady Di. This is horrible news. I was sick all day yesterday. Mm. And um, I have to go through the insurance company to get another phone. So well, you're sick morning. because of your alcoholism, not because you were mugged. Yeah. What? Excuse me? I heard you drove uh, Bill's truck all drunk. No, 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 no. Yes, 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 yes. He said oh, that. Wait, wait. He said on. you got all lit up and then went out to buy more beer and you were drunk driving his truck. I was awesome. 
ossified, I wouldn't be behind the wheel of that truck. Ossified? If, if I no, I was not. People think she's lying. Dude. So you only had a few beers. She's not lying about the mugging. That's pretty obvious. It's okay to drive, okay? Like, you know, okay to drive. Oh, oh, boy, she's going to kill somebody. A few people think she's waste. lying. Now, let me think this over. I'm not lying. That's it, why. She, she spends all her money, but she can't tell Bill. Uh-huh. You're not lying, right? What? What was that? Some people think you're lying about the mugging to cover up the I fact that you spent all the money. I don't care what they think. It's the truth. And what is Marion saying about this? Oh, uh, well, Mary, Mary feels bad for me about this. She said that she can't believe that that happened to me. Exactly. And I, I said, "Look, do you want me to do you want me to come in there one day with a police report to prove to everybody, or mail it to you, or something?" No, I believe you. To, you. to prove to you that I was mugged. I said no. I believe you. All right, see you tomorrow. Okay. Well, then you better. You know, you know the people. They. It's the truth. It's the truth. It is not a good yeah. neighborhood around there. Yeah, no right? shit. And, and uh, and I was the target. If it wasn't me, somebody else would have been the target. Yeah, maybe not. What happened to the chicken? <laughs> there were people. Oh my god, man! There were people getting pulled over there. You're a white person. You don't belong there. You're a white person. You don't belong there. He says. <laughs> I like Bill. He makes sense. <laughs> Bill. Good old. Yeah. What were you doing? You know what? I was getting food. You know, Whitey's always the victim. Yep. <laughs> Well, I had no business doing that, yeah, but... Oh. <laughs> she had no business getting another yeah. backpack. Uh -oh. She was down there trolling for dick, that's what she was oh, doing. Oh, yeah, some big black hog. Yeah. I was in the mood to get some chicken. All right. I got drunk. Instead, and uh, then I walked out, no more money, no nothing, all I did was go home. All right, hold on, hold on, Dallas wants in. Tony in Dallas, uh, you're on with Lady Die. what's up? There is no doubt that she spent all that money, and she came up with a BS story. And okay. uh, probably within the next week, that phone will just mysteriously appear. Uh huh. So, what, no hold doubt. Hold on, hold on, stop! All right, all right, go ahead. Go ahead. He already said all what right. he said. He doesn't believe your story. He thinks you made it up because you spent all the money. First of all, where would I spend all the money all at once at? On beer. On beer. Not at the gym. Oh, that's impossible. <laughs> That is impossible. It is not. Well, I was thinking. All right, it's not impossible. You spent half of it on beer on the first day of the oh, weekend. No, no. God, yes. No. I I paid my phone bill sixty five dollars. Sixty. Okay? And All right. then another forty fifty dollars on uh, beers, and then she jumps oh. jumps on the uh, the, the old train. Me. I'm listening. Listen to me. All right, I went to the Blarney Rock. So belligerent. I had a few beers there because they're cheap over there anyway. They're good over there. I took the subway to the Blarney Rock, right? Okay. We, we got all the details. Thank you. All right. We heard and, this uh, already. All right. If there's nothing... Two beers in the Blarney Rock. Uh, we, we got all this already. Okay. All right, but I'm trying to explain... We're pretty much done. Blarney Rock over our head. Yeah. We heard everything. I I had a I, I had chicken fingers because now I'm starting to get my appetite. Well, where did you we... actually go after the radio show on the subway? <laughs> no, <Jimmy. laughs> what? what what place did you drink at in the oh city? My God. No, don't do this. Forget it. Forget it. Oh. Forget that. <laughs> Took the money out of the till. Remember, oh, we did. I annoyed with that till. <laughs> we did five days with Lady Di. You only did four. Okay. <laughs> Oh, yes. Bill. A, Bill. a domestic. Bill is an axe. Okay. All right. What, um, what, what okay. is Bill saying? Oh, something about the, hundred, the, the first 140. Uh, wow. Yeah, that you drank away. Yeah, you drank that away. That's when we realized maybe we should cut down the, the funds a little bit. The what? Cut, cut down what a little bit? Oh, boy. The day we gave you 140, it was gone the next day. We, we started thinking, wow, yeah. okay, maybe we shouldn't just be yeah. throwing money at her. Well, that was my fault. Oh, really? I, <laughs> well, that was, that was definitely my fault. Hey, what's okay. the place you drank at in the city? No, huh? What place did you drink at in the city? I just told you the Blarney Rock. Oh my God, Blarney Rock! Oh my God! You never, you never heard of the Blarney Rock? Oh my God! With the Blarney Rock, where is it? It's an Irish bar. What? what? I know the people in there. What the Shamrock? The Blarney, Blarney Rock. How do you know the people at the Blarney Rock? I've been going there for years. Mary and I have been going there for a long time. Oh my God. All right. Well, you know are we done with her? Oh, that? my God. We have the bartenders and stuff, the barmaids. That's great.
the waitresses. We- All right, everybody. The janitor, the fucking guy that cleans the windows. How- yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, no. Sean in Long Island actually grew up right where um, uh, Lady Die was mugged. If you're just tuning in, Lady Die was mugged over the weekend. We were going to move on from Lady Die, but yes. obviously we have to see what this is all about. Sean, what do you got? Or shit. Hey, guys, I me? Yeah, yeah. Hey, no, I didn't grow up there. I went to college there for oh. three years right what, down the street. What, col- college? what college is nearby? Uh, Kane University. Okay. It's right oh, in your okay, okay. street. I, I, uh, I had a... <laughs> Uh, my I, university. Had a college, I had a college house there for three years, right down the street. Used to go to that liquor store she's talking about and everything. Okay. There's go ahead, no die. way that she's lying. She's not lying. Okay. This is, this is the worst neighborhood ever. You know, those guys just hang out outside that store all day, all night. And they're just looking for people like her. I'm actually yep. a white kid, too. So they were looking for people like us, but we were a little smarter than that. Exactly. She's just walking around like a dummy. Yeah, she's drinking a cheers here in New York. <laughs> Yeah, no, there's, there's no way she's lying. They just look for people like us. And if she's drunk and staggering a little bit, and, uh, and her pocketbook's all willy nilly like open, she is, and the guy looked at her, uh, saw the money, <laughs> right. she's pulling it out. Right. Absolutely. absolutely. Oh, yeah. We never left our house. Uh, no, no, she no, did no. everything yeah. wrong, I bet. I mean, everything you could do wrong, she did wrong that day. Everything you everything. could do wrong. Yeah. Yeah, since 1960. Instead of like maybe <laughs> pulling out a 20 out of the wad, she pulls the whole wad of money wad out. out. Oh, I'll take some chicken. <laughs> <Boring>. <laughs> right. You guys know that. Were you with me? Yes, we were with you for one week. How do I know this? You're not an enigma. She goes, how do you know this? Because you told us. And it robbed her once. <laughs> I opened up my pocketbook. You probably saw, looked inside, saw the money, and I don't even know it, okay? I pulled out whatever I had to All right, out, goodbye. <laughs> All right. I have had it I'm with this. I'm done with her. Had it goodbye, with her. Goodbye, die. Be well. We wish you well. And take care. Had it. Godspeed. All right, let it die. Well, it's... Uh, what can I tell you? I mean... You've told us everything. You, right? you, you won't tell us where you drank in the city, but you told us everything else. <laughs> don't say it. Please don't say it. I am bruised. My elbow... She's my bruised. Elbow, oh. And uh, my knee is bruised. Mm. Okay. Well, so is your liver, by the way. Exactly. Yeah, might as well add that to the list. Poor little fat apple. <laughs> her weeping liver. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. weeping into her abdomen. Yeah, so it's building a flood. Flood. Who gets so bruised by getting pushed down? Yeah, exactly. I got bruised by being pushed down, yes. So you got a bruised elbow and a bruised what? Knee? Yeah, bruised knee. All right. I, I, I hope you're doing Not well. Funny. Godspeed. We didn't say it was funny. Yes. That guy that did it probably was like, this has to be a setup. <laughs> like, this has to be a, right. a cop sting. Right. This is too easy. Well, you know, I mean, but he's like, I got to give it a shot, though. This <laughs> Has, uh, someone twittered, ONA Blarney Rock. <laughs> <laughs> ONA Blarney Rock. <laughs> Listen, I need to ask you a question. Uh, uh, no, we're not uh, hiring. No, no, really, seriously. What do you need for your driver's license? Uh, you need proof of address? How about the ability to drive sober? Yeah. How about that for first uh, for one? Yeah, I would start there. Take care, Doc. I'm Di. asking you a serious question. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, I'm not the DMV. Well, yeah, what the fuck do you think we are? I don't know. You need two pieces of identification. Yeah. Right. Like what? Like what? Give your, bring your license. Everything that, <laughs> <laughs> everything that was in your pocketbook. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Proof of where you live, I think. I think like a pay stub helps. I don't know. A phone bill, maybe a birth certificate, that type I don't of shit. Have my birth certificate. Yeah, you're in, to... you're gonna be. Uh, it's gonna be a problem. A yeah. passport, right? Yeah. Where's your passport? Uh, the police report itself, right? Uh huh. All right, hold on. I'm going to Doctor <laughs> Joe, in fucking... Minnesota. Doctor Joe, you're on with Lady Di. Oh, hey guys. <laughs> uh, let me take Lady Di off your hands for you. I've got a job opportunity for. Her. Yeah. Have you ever heard of Scared Straight? Scared Straight? No. Yeah, yeah. so Scared Straight <laughs> is uh, to help kids that are fucking up become better people. So we're going to use, use you to scare these kids. <laughs> there How would you, you feel about teenage boys changing your diapers so that way they see what uh, alcoholism can oh, do? Oh, brother, please. Please. No, hey, I'm no, a doctor. No, no, no. I am a doctor, not like well, Dr. Steve, more like Dr. Pepper or Dr. Yeah. Dre, Oof. but I'm still a doctor. Oh. Okay. All right, Dr. Joe. She ain't listening. Oh. Hey. Oh. Unfortunately, uh, we had to. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm getting this from somebody. Mm-hmm. Ask her why she has so many liens and judgment, judgments against her. 
Oh. What were they for? Uh oh. Lady Di. What happened? Say that one more time. What'd you say? She had to take a sip. You heard that, right? Uh -huh. Why do you have so many liens and judgments against you? Liens and judgments against me? I don't know. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why. But do you have them? I'm just, uh, I, I'm, I'm just being myself, and if these people want to judge me, let them judge me. Oh, no. <laughs> I can't. I can't. Oh, my God. I can't. <laughs> this isn't real. Leans? Well, that's from the alcoholism Leans. and the I, I and judgment. Well, I am on Twitter, so you kind of get uh, a little of that. Oh, wait a minute! Wait a minute! Um, Passing bad checks. Proof of, uh, um, you know, proof to get my driver's license back. What about my checkbook? We're not talking about that anymore. Yeah, bring your license with you. You're fine. <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy, stop. Oh. Done with this mess. <laughs> we, we did what we could. Uh, fucking won't stop. This is no, why. No. You, this is why you, you, you just don't get involved in the. No, end. no. It, you don't. You just don't, unfortunately. I mean, that's... Ugh. It's probably horrible to say, but this is what happens when you do try to get involved and help somebody out. Uh, huh? I, already, I already got proof of address. I bet I already But got. what about the liens and judgments against you? That's court stuff. There's some legal things against you? Right. Like what? I don't know. I don't you tell know. me. I don't know. Maybe this person could give me a little more info than just that. Mm -hmm. Reliable uh, source, by the way. Oh. Lady Di, you're a goddamn mess. I, oh. You don't want help. Uh, you're just going to continue to wither away. How did you get home, considering the guy took your car keys? He didn't take my car keys. Where were my they? Were my, they were in my jacket. Thank God. Oh, okay. They were in my mm -hmm. jacket. Man. Right, Otherwise, those would have been gone, too. And Bill would have fl flipped shit. Wasn't that what Bill's car? Huh? Wasn't that Bill's car? It's our car. It's our truck. It's both of ours. Yeah, it's Bill's. It's our truck. You drive it drunk. I I was not drunk. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Bill said Bill you said were said drunk. You were. And that's why you left the house in the first place. To go get beer, even though the fridge was full of beer. You went out, and then you decide you want chicken. So you go to the fucking, you go to Compton for fucking chicken. No, no, um, no. I, no, I just, no, yes, yes, yes. I want to see oh. beer for the next day, you know. Beer for the next day while she's drinking beer that night. Right. You are a goddamn disaster. Oh, there we go. Jesus. Yeah, well. Uh, Lady Die. Yes, yes. Judgment and liens. Oh. All these? Judgment and liens. What is judgment... Judgments and liens. There's ten of them. You tell me. Ten oh, against you. Public records, statewide personal search. You got a lot of judgments and liens against you. There's ten of them. Mm. Ten of them. So let me know what they are because I don't even know what they are. No. <laughs> doesn't really. It doesn't say. really say. Okay. Well, if it doesn't say, then hey. What whatever. does that mean? People looking for yeah, know. she she owes money to things. Right, she's uh, yeah, a lot of probably um, bad yeah, checks. From a long time ago, credit uh, that you didn't you didn't pay back, things like that. There's ten of them, so, but you have no idea. Credit cards you never paid. Apparently, a lot from is that true or yeah? Apparently, a lot from Capital One and the heating company. <laughs> You're not paying your heating bill. What are you and Capital about? One, Capital One, you know, credit card, you probably chalked up a bunch of credit card debt and then just threw the credit cards away. Right? That was a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> See, that, <laughs> that was a long time ago. She goes from, what are you talking about? To, uh -huh. That was a long time ago. Overdrawn accounts wait a minute, wait at the a bank. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 wait yeah. a minute. Yeah. Wait a minute. Yeah, what? Okay, wait a minute. Um... How in the world did you find all this stuff out? It's very easy. It's the internet. It's uh, 2014. People's information is available everywhere. Oh, jeez. That was such... Oh, my God. I thought I took care of all that. Oh, did you? Yeah. Yeah, and, I and, I did. And uh, what about bank accounts that um, that uh, were overdrawn? And, uh, no, no. What? Bank accounts that are over... No. Yeah. No way. Like, like you overdraw a bank account and then just never we're pay. Getting, we're getting what they are. Yeah. If you wait, like, literally 15 more seconds, uh -huh. they're coming off the printer. <laughs> 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 Lady died. There's always another... 
There's always another layer with you, Lady Di. There's always something else. Oh, yeah. We go whole week and you don't even tell us that you were in the Navy. Yeah, you didn't even tell us that. Well, I didn't think that was important. <laughs> <laughs> She's no, in the fucking was, Navy. An important subject. And but that I'm you were really AWOL. Like, that you got a dishonorable discharge because you were AWOL. But Russ. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I just did not think that that was important. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, anyway, yeah, I was in, I was in the service. Yes, I was. Right. Yeah. I was in there for two years. And then they threw you out. Oh, boy. Yeah, yeah, they did. I, I didn't want to get thrown out, though. I just wanted to... Uh, Why did they throw you out? What was their reasoning? They threw me out because, because I was... Uh, I, I was just leaving the base all the time. I had unlimited liberty, which is probably uh, their mistake, if you ask me. <laughs> Wait, she had unlimited liberty, so yeah. then it's okay to leave the base. Yeah, it is. You have unlimited liber liberty. You can leave the base anytime you want to. <clears throat> so what was the... Oh, you were coming back drunk or something? No, I wasn't a drinker back then. No. <sighs> Why you, do they you, throw you out of the Navy? I one, I just wanted to leave the base. I did not want to be there. That's all. Why did they throw you out of the Navy? They threw me out because uh, because I was uh, I was able all the time. So when I came back, they said, "Listen, um, uh, you know, uh, we're going to have to discharge you." You know. So they had to discharge me. I'm just waiting for the uh, records yeah, and we can move on. Stock is dropping the more she talks. <laughs> yes. I was young back then. You know, right. I was and what's your excuse now? Young and full of cum, you're right? So, you're so much wiser now. Yeah. All right. Something like that. Whatever. Um, yeah. No, no, no. But um, I, I really I really wanted to stick it out. I, I wanted to stay in there. But um, they just uh, said, here, you have to go home. That was you didn't want to stick it out. You didn't want to be part of it, really. Yeah. If you're if you're leaving all the time. Yeah, I know, but I did not want to. I I did. See, I was only nineteen Here years it comes. old. I was just stolen. I was barely all right. out of high school. Okay, I was out of high school. Yeah. All right, nineteen years old. Okay. All right. Uh -huh. Wait a minute. Hold on. I graduated high oh, school. Oh boy, Capital <laughs> One. All right. Here. I had. Well, let's see. What, we got some fun oh. things. Oh my God! We're listening. Wait, hold on. Forget it. Forget it. We're Forget listening. It. We're so, listening. Capital One does not like you. What? Capital One. Capital One. Capital One. Wow. Uh, Petro Heating Oil and oh Services, Crown Asset Management LLC. They're pulling up old files on me, Bill. Oh my God. Century Financial Service, Midland Funding. Oh, boy. Put e on the phone. Huh? Put e hmm. on the phone. What? Why e -rock? Okay. Hmm. E hold hold on. on huh? Put e on the phone. Lady Di, it's me. It's e -rock. Yeah, hi, e -rock. How you doing? Hey. Why? Wait. What? Hold, hold, hold on a second. Hold on. Why are you pulling, uh, you know... Why are you pulling up all this stuff on me? Uh, you know, I just figured I would do it because I have access to it and, and uh, the NSA stuff, so I figured I would just do it. Yeah, but now it's all over the air. Yeah, I know, but I figured, what the heck. Oh, God. You see the amounts? Me. Are they all different amounts? 8900 The first one is for ninety. Two hundred dollars, Capital One. The second one is for ninety two hundred, Capital One. The third is for uh, eight thousand sure nine hundred from Capital One. Wait, Opie, you think it's the same one with interest just being added? I'm not no, sure. I, don't think so. I think it's the same one with interest being added. And then the heating oil, that's for seven hundred dollars. I don't think they're the same because they have different filing numbers. Oh my God! Then there's Crown Asset Management for thirty three hundred. Another Crown Asset Management for uh, around the same thirty three hundred. No, it might be the same. And then Petch. Petro is another seven hundred again. How does this work? Then there's Midland funding for just under a thousand. Then there's New Century Financial Services for fifty four hundred. You're right, and, Diane. And then another for Midland for just under a thousand. What are you doing? Are you like opening up accounts and fucking around a little bit? No, listen to me. Those accounts were open when I was working. Okay? <laughs> when I was working. And then when I became homeless, there was nothing I could do about it. I mean, it, it, it's so it's so hard to explain. You know, oh, no, it's uh, not. You just didn't pay your bills. I lost my job. <clears throat> when I lost mm -hmm. my job, I had no source of income whatsoever. Lady Di, are you also known as Diana Schmitz? That was that was my. You have to tell everybody my married name. 
What does it matter? That, yep. was, that was when I was married. Okay. That was my name. So basically, when... Um, Why are you telling everybody this for? Basically, when you lost your job, <laughs> you couldn't pay your bills. That's all this is. Right. You lost your job, you couldn't pay your bills. But it looks like you're opening up all sorts of accounts, though. What? Uh, I think you were doing okay. some uh, fooling around here. I thought I really... You open up a new bank account, you get a little... Uh, you use credit the, card. Yeah, you use that credit card. And then you move on to the next bank. There's a there's too many banks involved here. I'm trying to explain something to you. I already had those credit cards. I had them already. For four different banks? One, I two. I had those credit cards already. And then some personal thing here. I don't know what that is. I'm not going to say that. Name. Why'd you have so many uh, credit cards? Yeah. I don't. You know what? I don't know. I just. I had a lot of credit cards back then. I don't and, know. Uh, and you maxed them all out. Well, what do you, you know, I mean, I like I said, I lost my job. And you know, what was I going to do? You know, I had to live on something. Oh, so, but I thought I took care of all that already. Oh, yeah. How? It's like, well, you paid off so the tens max, of thousands of dollars. So it looks like the max was 10000 per right. credit card. 10000 per card. And she paid back oh, maybe like yeah, the okay. first payment. <laughs> and that was it. <laughs> I, I oh man I I I don't, I don't even want to talk about it anymore. I oh. can't pay these people. I, I I really wish I could, but I can't. Lady Di, is there one I aspect of your life, you Lady Di? Lady Di, is there one aspect of your life that you feel you kind of have uh, you you got right? Uh, well, first of all, when Bill took me in, you know, then, then that isn't you. That's Bill. Again. Huh? There's not one thing you're doing in your life that you could look at and go, well, at least I'm doing this right. Nothing. Well, uh, yeah, there kind of is. You know, I mean, I mean, I got a job after Bill took me in, and that was for a temporary agency, you know, temp agency. Years ago. And I, and, and I was working, I worked there for around two or three years. How come when we talk about things like liens and judgments, you go, oh, that was old, that was years ago. But when we talk about jobs, you're right. like, oh, I had a job. That was years ago. How funny is it yeah. that it's lean? Yeah. A it's lean. A, <laughs> lean. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing lean nothing about you. Yes, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I just... Uh, hold on. Hold on a minute. Let me just say hi to uh, Ryan. Ryan! Yeah. Hey. Hello. Can you just please hang up on Lady Die for us, please? The listeners everywhere I want to mm. get to the with. I, all, all you had to do is ask. That's fine. All you had to do is ask. That's it. All you got to do is ask. Bye bye. Ugh. It's exhausting. It is fucking exhausting. We were gonna move on today from the whole lady die thing, and then it turns out she gets mugged. I was thinking of like the lady die from NEW days, right? And what a mess we thought she was then, right? She was fucking upstanding citizen. Oh, big time. Back then compared to uh, compared to now. And then she did get a lot of money from her dad. Mm -hmm. Yep. And she obviously didn't use it to. Try to you know pay back some of that stuff. Just a waste. We give her a week of like kind of showing her what uh, what it's like to you know get a schedule, wake up, right, do something, earn some money, right, and then she just fucking blows it on beer, driving drunk, going walking around with her fucking head in the clouds in a horrid neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> Just, just doing everything wrong. You everything could, you could wrong. possibly do in one day. Everything wrong. Have too many beers at home, then start driving around, then go to a horrible uh, neighborhood to a chicken place. Chicken place, and <laughs> flashing some hundies around <laughs> with nothing but cold hard cash on you. Like what the fuck? Oh, uh, get they're just sitting there. So the guy is sizing her up the whole time. Oh my god! I don't think you could do anything more wrong in one day. Just fucked up. All right. Jesus. There's your update. There you go, people. There's your update. Lady Di got mugged. All right. Oh, and I said it. I said there's no way yes. she'll have the money she, by yep. Monday. And regardless I didn't, of I the circumstance. Yeah, but she did this herself. Yes. She could have pre prevented all this. Of course. I love chicken, too, but, man, I'm not going... I'm not going to crown chicken. <laughs> no, 9.30 at night on a Saturday. In the middle of the ghetto. 
Nine thirty means you know sun's down. Right. No way. Do you know how good though crown chicken must taste? Oh, it's oh, it's got to be amazing. It's fucking those places in the hood it's that have good. chicken that everyone. I bet that I, I don't know. How, I don't know what the hygiene is there. It might be great. It might not be. They uh, probably laugh at KFC. Oh, it's like probably KFC. so good. They, they probably laugh. Mm. Like you have no idea how good chicken could actually be. Yeah, and I do love KFC, but Crown's got to be so much better. I haven't eaten KFC in years, but I want to. That was I my hangover it. food when I was in Buffalo. Yeah, go on a KFC run, get a bucket. KFC, some of those mashed potatoes. It is right? pretty gravy. fucking tasty. Oh, it's ridiculous! <laughs> like how just good loaded it is. with salt and grease. It's but wonderful. Wasn't making a lot of money, but spent the extra on all white meat. Oh yeah, got to go all white. It's probably not good for you. I mean, you should need it more than like every other day. I, I'll have it like every other day, sure. but I won't, I won't go every day with <laughs> so it. Like, not you know. every day. No, no, be irresponsible. Oh, uh, boy. All right, then. We're going to take a break here. All right, Dan. We certainly will move on to other things. Don't Please. you worry. Relax. The Opie and Anthony Show will be right back. On Sirius XM. <laughs> 